we are going to create an automation to target past clients that we've done business with, but we are currently not doing business with. And we'll show you how we do that here. So this can be one of your strongest groups. You've made placements with them in the past. Um, you're not, you haven't had any job orders with them recently. Uh, it can be a great group to always kind of stay on top of to you know, make sure that you're top of mind with them. They might not have any current opportunities, but when they do, you wanna to be top of mind so they think of you. So the first thing we're gonna look for is client contacts that we've had a placement with historically over time. So there is that number. And we're gonna look for client contacts that we haven't had a job in the past year. And then we can also add in some status criteria just to make sure that the person that we're targeting, for example, you know, isn't a DNC, isn't uh, you know a DNU, so don't use, don't contact. Uh, they left the company, they got archived for some reason, that kind of thing. Uh, we wanted to ensure that. Uh, and then we can also, well, is not those values, not the other way around. And then we also probably want to hone in on the client status as well, which is, is nice. We'll go back to status here, so company status. So this is the, the company that the sales contact is associated with. So again, we probably just want to make sure that it's um, you know a, an account that's not, that's in one of our kind of good standings uh, kind of deal. But uh, all these lists, typically when we do these for clients, it'll populate with people. So th this is a, a gold, lead list essentially people you've done business with in the past you don't have any really active jobs or, or work with them uh, they haven't kind of left the company it's a company that's in good standing so this is a fantastic segment to run through uh, kind of a, a communication campaign which of course you can kind of drip out some some messages to kind of over time and you know typically the the content here you know you'd have something like you know, just wanted to, to reach out, touch base, see if, if uh, you know, you had any needs. You, know, you can you can make this the time between the messages. You might reach out once a month. You might reach out, you know, once a, a quarter. You know, that's kind of up to up to your uh, discretion there. Uh, but again, kind of the reach out and the, and the idea behind the messages would be, uh, if you're doing it, reach out to the client would be, uh, just kind of to get top of mind, but then you could also do a notification in which you could just alert. This could be a, you know, an internal notification that goes to the sales contact owner or someone else that you specify uh, just, just to make sure, uh, you know, let them know that, Hey, this is somebody we've been, done business in the past. We haven't talked to them recently. I haven't had a job with them in a little while. Let's see if there's any opportunities.